Ta lofa lava and welcome to Mesina Treasures of Samoa where we amplify Samoan culture. Today we have another Samoa vlog for you and we are starting in the town area of Apia so we're just going around the what do you call it circle thing roundabout with <laughs> with the time the clock in and we're heading along Beach Road in front of the government building towards Matautu. Um, on the left, on the right, you see Vodafone, and we just passed ANZ. On the left is the government building, and we will see on your right hand side the Catholic Cathedral coming up. Um, there's more of the government building and the Samoa Tourism Authority hut is there. Um, then we're headed towards the seawall. You can see the harbour and yeah, we're over the bridge. Beautiful Apia Harbour. On your right hand side is the Australian High Commission. That is where I had my first job in, in Samoa. Um, so that's the new Samoa Commercial Bank building on your right hand side that we just saw. Um, very beautiful building and yeah then we were back at the government building where we went to get Logan's passport stamped um, yep then we ate we ate at Kung Noodles there's Oka there's noodle soups we had lamb soup and curry we also started doing morning seawall walks with my dad. Um, it was beautiful views, absolutely gorgeous. The scenery was beautiful. The weather was lovely. It was not as warm as you would have during the day. So excellent time to be exercising. Then by the end of it, you got the most amazing lights to take photos as you see here how gorgeous is that um then yes there's the fire station and again we're going to see the new Samuel commercial bank which again beautiful um and i'm going to zoom in to again <laughs> the australian high commission where i had my first job in Samuel. Then we went to the beach. We went to Aninoa and spent the day at Coconut Beach Resort. Absolutely gorgeous. It is free to use the beach if you are not a guest. You will not have access to any of the pool or the facilities, but you have access to this absolutely gorgeous beach. Um, we loved our time there. It was clean it felt safe um, yeah absolutely gorgeous I, and if you look closely there's some little fish in the water it's not deep during the time that we went there so it was great for um, families we also ate there um, I had a fish burger it was a full-on fish steak so definitely try their food as well. Logan had some kind of a burger. Then we kept swimming again and it was a gorgeous day. It was overcast but still absolutely beautiful. So yeah. Then we headed back home and we made it home in time for the all you can eat buffet at the curry house. If you have not tried the curry house, try the curry house their buffet is 55 dollars per person on a thursday evening definitely worth the money then we are on another seawalk adventure um can i just reiterate how beautiful the sunrise is during this time so this is giving off purple vibes but it was actually more of a red orange teal i used the flash to take our photo this time and my face did not care for it <laughs> and this is us having more selfie time um yeah so this is more of the color of the sunset that you would usually see with your own eyes obviously the camera 
gives off different color vibes but this is more of the vibe or the coloring that you will see during the morning walks if you go near the seawall and again the lighting absolutely amazing great time for you to take photos um, yeah definitely recommend walking on the seawall in the mornings there are lots of people there so you have safety in numbers if you are a single person traveling um yeah yeah then logan practiced sivafi on the seawall Faisalo on our deck outside our house then we visited family in Popota and then we headed to Fat Burger where we ate delicious burgers so I chose the gluten free bun just because I'm supposed to not eat gluten yeah so they do have a gluten free bun option if you have allergies um I forgot to ask for no onions because I'm not supposed to eat onions but they are very good at adapting to your allergies if you need to request that. So gluten free buns are available at Fat Burger. They are delicious and very yummy. I did not check because I'm not a celiac. I did not check if they were celiac appropriate. Where so you might want to ask that if you do order that and you are a celiac um they had new they had milkshakes and Lillian had a beef burger and yeah it was all delicious definitely recommend fat burgers then we went and visited and uh, we were able to see a 60 dollar samo dollar note in person so they are real then I picked up my wedding dress from Naomati Creations. Then we tried, we had some Giordano's pizza, which we ordered through Seki Eats. I will be doing a review of Seki Eats, so make sure to keep an eye out for that. Taya Monomia, good morning. Today we are headed out to watch soccer. So, um, Samo actually has some really good sports other than rugby and netball and soccer is one of them so we're gonna head out and have a watch of some of their games then we went to some more stationary books and looked for some dresses um they have a wide collection of pia i think it's called um very beautiful very lovely out of my budget but gorgeous if you can afford that um some more stationary books then we headed to mari's mari's cafe is one of our favorite places it is air conditioned their food quality is consistent I had pancakes with bacon and egg inside it. Logan had French toast and waffles. We love their food. Definitely try Mari's Cafe in Tamalini. Um, side note, I used to work above their building, so I ate there quite a lot. And I love it. Then we had a photo shoot with my cousin Faith. Um, keep an eye out for some of her shoot material that we are going to post in our social media shortly and Logan did more Siva Afi practice at Talmesina.
Look, just me and you, now could you stay with that? Really got my vision set on you, I swear I prayed for that Even in our darkest times, I never parted ways with that Late night conversations in my whip How you feeling about this? Telling me that maybe we should split So that I can focus on this gift What if, what if, what if? What if I make it, then I leave you for some other bit? Baby girl, I told you, you the only chick I'm fucking with Baby girl, it's complicated, I know you've been tired of waiting Can't let you go, but I know this road gonna need that kind of patience I'ma need you with me now to hold me down, hold this crown I hope this sound gonna hit you back so that one day I can show you how I did it for you Alright, 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 uh, and how I had to go and get it for you No lie, no lie, no lie, baby one. We started the day again with another seawall walk How beautiful is that? Like, look at that color. Absolutely gorgeous. Seawall walks in the mornings were 
a great start to our day. It helped us to see beautiful things, to clear our heads, and yeah, we were keeping healthy. So, Seawall Walk, definitely recommend it in the mornings or even in the late in the evenings. So, have a check it out. There's my Seawall Walk buddies. And then Logan went to see Afi practice again. So Logan was very blessed to practice with Yeti to Omalatai. Um, absolutely wonderful person, very kind, very generous and giving of his knowledge of Siva Afi and just sharing everything he knows with Logan. And we are so blessed that he was able to train with him and we hope to future collaborations um, in the future whether here or in Samoa again. So thank you again to Yeti To Malatai and we'll put his links and stuff down below. So make sure to check that out in the description. Follow him on social media and keep an eye out for him. He is amazing. I got a drip addiction. I'm out here handling business, give me the beat, and I'm finna kill it. I'm feeling like soldier, pretty boy swag. I got a drip addiction. I'm really out here with the team, though we grinding hard to stack up the green. I'm ballin' out like Kobe Bean, I'm bitter like a coffee bean. So now you got me feeling me. I'm the man up in the house, I wear the big boy pants, and I don't need a belt, but no, I'm still the champ. Shouldn't be a doubt, and if you didn't know, yes, you know now. Geek, saw a strip like whoa. Make it hits like whoa. No, we really finna blow. I'ma kill it like whoa. I'm out here handling business, give me the beat, and I'm finna kill it. I'm feeling like soldier, pretty boy swag. I got a drip addiction. I'm out here handling business, give me the beat, and I'm finna kill it. I'm feeling like soldier, pretty boy swag. I got a drip addiction. I'm coming in beast mode, man, it's easy. One on one, I know no one can beat me. Competition hard, gotta be kidding. Playing the game, you know that I'm killing. Spitting fire like a dragon, charge our shit finna blow up like an arc star. In New York, you know I'm really rock hard. Feeling like Posty, I'm a rock star. I'm out here handling business, give me the beat, and I'm finna kill it. I'm feeling like soldier. Soldier, pretty boy swag, I got a drip addiction. I'm out here handling business, give me the beat, and I'm finna kill it. I'm feeling like soldier, pretty boy swag, I got a drip addiction. I'm out here handling business, give me the beat, and I'm finna kill it. I'm feeling like soldier, pretty boy swag, I got a drip addiction. I'm out here handling business, give me the beat, and I'm finna kill it. I'm feeling like soldier, pretty boy swag, I got a drip addiction. After practice, we drove to the airport to pick up my younger sister who is getting married and her beautiful family. Um, then we ate pizza for dinner. We didn't go for a walk this morning. We stayed home and cleaned a bit and we ended up having breakfast with my sister and her family at Pacific Jewel. They have amazing food. It's like you're eating in a beautiful garden so definitely try out pacific jewel their food is amazing the atmosphere is gorgeous um and they also have things that you can purchase in their store like clothing jewelry etc um yeah pacific jewel in villi le villi then we went to visit my auntie and we went shopping again we went to eveni um, and also to Tano. I love their things and I wish that they had them here in Australia. So yeah, this is my shopping haul from Tano and Eveni. Talpalaba. Um, so we went shopping today. We went to Eveni and we also went to Tano. Um, I managed to get a few things from Eveni, but how cute is the bag? Like. The presentation at Eveni is amazing. Even got this little bow ribbon there. Definitely, definitely check out Eveni. Um, so, let me open up what I got. So, I needed clothes for work that were cute and that had pockets. And so, these dresses all have pockets. I 
can move this back and take a video. So, it's just a plain dress. It's got a tie at the front, but it even has the cute um, coconut shell. What do you call those? Buttons. And um, it has a pocket on one side. Let me figure out which side that is. Oh, the dress I looked at had a pocket. I don't see a pocket on this. <laughs> oh, because they're in the front. That's where they are. <laughs> it's in the front. Got a pocket in the front. Um, so this is dress number one. Very pretty. And then I have. Um, we're going to pins now, and I need little white dress. And so we're going to this one, which I can also wear to work. So if you look close, it has the LA design on it, which is really pretty. And again, it has a single pocket on the side, which is wonderful. And so those are from Eleni. Vinny, sorry, Ebony. Um, a hundred and something dollars each, which is good quality. Um, and when you convert it, it's about eighty, ninety dollars. Yeah, for each dress, which is probably what I would have paid for something like that in Australia. And then we went to Tano and I wasn't planning on buying anything, but then like, I saw this. So I got the Tano brand bag. If you've been to, what is that shop? Ikea, and they give out these big massive bags. Well, this one is kind of those, but then, how pretty is that? Yeah, so excited to have this big bag. They're awesome for, um, and we also got these towels, Tanya towels. So got one for the week. And my so it also has these. So they're, they're a pretty thin towel, but when you're going to the beach, that's probably all you need. Um, my own is black, it's got Tanoa and the beautiful Tanoa designs. I love it. It's beautiful. And if it, the towels were about seven, $80, $80 each, so $80 to fight up by about $240, so like. $41, $42 each, yeah, which I think is good because you can't actually go to any place in Australia and purchase a towel like this, so I'm really pleased with this and if I have more in my budget I will probably go back and get more, but yeah, that's my haul from Evini and Tanoa for today. So this is my family home in Popolta and I'm showing you this because 
this is where we lived most of the time that we were in Samoa. It's absolutely beautiful and it brings back so many memories. So this is the house that my grandfather built with his own hands. Um, there have been changes over the years but that's my family home and that's where my heart belongs because that's where my family are from. We have grown some different plants so now we have lemongrass at the front where we can make lemongrass tea from. Um, my auntie has started to grow some native salmon plants that she will be selling. This is our beautiful dog. Hello lady. She is so cute. Um, yeah, so my auntie will be selling some native salmon plants from her storefront over here. Um, keep an eye out on our social media so that we can keep you updated on how you can purchase native salmon plants. So I know there's some... Um, what did she have there? <laughs> she has some muscle oi. I know she had muscle oi growing. So I don't know all of the plant names. But she does. And that's her background. So she's full of knowledge. Few and very willing to share her knowledge with you. So um, when I share her details in our social medias. Make sure to copy. Um, <laughs> make sure to follow us on Instagram and Facebook. So that we can keep you updated on when she um begins her business and starts selling these plants now um these grounds um it goes all the way down to a, a valley where there's a river the river is no longer running as well um as much as it used to um there's a dam up there there's water shortages so the land has changed a lot. Um, when we lived there, we had fruit galore, um, Cyclone Evan and the other cyclone more recently made it so that most of the fruit that was there is no longer there and we have to restart again from the beginning. So here is some noni plants with the noni that they make nonu juice. I don't like it but it has health benefits that some people really enjoy so yeah um and this is where we used to go down the path towards the mukuka where they had a little fale that they cooked the umu in and yeah because not we didn't have people living in the space for quite some time it's become overgrown and yeah it needs work and we're going to be doing some great things here in Popota and we hope to keep you updated on what those plans are for our family in the future um yeah it's a beautiful place and we love it and yeah that's our vlog like subscribe